Hello chickens, this is Mason again, and today I am going to do another My Thoughts video because I thought you guys were getting bored and, and I decided to upload another video. As you can tell from the title, these are my thoughts on the Banjo-Kazooie and Banjo-Tooie's Stop and Swap. Yeah, um, first Rare had a great idea to hack Banjo-Kazooie and then put the whole stop and swap thing in those two games. Like, those two games were Rare's best piece of work. Anyway. Anyway, how to do the whole stop and swap thing? It all started when you get 100 jiggies. And at the ending cutscene of um, Banjo-Kazooie... Um, Mumbo had some pictures, well, they're motion pictures, you know, get it? <laughs> anyway, um, I, so, um, what I saw in those pictures, there were two eggs, one ice key, on three images, or, um, it was a pink egg, a blue egg, and, and an ice key. A ginormous ice key. And the whole stop and swap thing would get revealed in Banjo-Tooie. Now, I know you're probably asking, what is the whole stop and swap thing? Well, it's a pretty bad idea for Rare. Why did they think it was a bad idea, you may ask? Well, within 10 seconds, you had you have to switch out Banjo-Kazooie. Why? With Banjo Tooie while it's still turned on, um, in ten seconds. But then in 1999, um, the year after Banjo Kazooie was made, and the year before Banjo Tooie was made, um, they put it for one second on there to make it have memory on there. You have to be fast as the flash to do that, but not all of us are gifted with super speed. And, um, the, and you know, the whole cheating kind of thing, it's, it's kind of like cheats, and you can get really cool stuff of it for both of those games. Like, you can turn Kazooie into a dragon, you can have a new move by slamming Kazooie on the ground, which is bird abuse, and you know, a lot of special features, you know, and there's something weird in Grabbed by the Ghoulies, the game, please, oh my god, don't give, play that game, it's horrible, but there is one thing that was weird about it, when you go into a classroom and there's a chalkboard that says, get four eggs, get ice key, and unlock all the things you need. And also, for Donkey Kong 64, that also has to make it for it, which Banjo-Kazooie's levels were moved to um, Donkey Kong 64. There is a level on there called Fungus Forest, but there is a level on Banjo-Kazooie that's known as Fungi Forest. And, um, you know... And what if Stop and Swap could get Fungi Forest in it, you know? I'm getting way too deep in this. So those are my thoughts on Banjo-Kazooie Stop and Swap. Now I have to find out what Stop and Swap 2 is all about. Well, here we go again. But that the Stop and Swap 2 thoughts are coming soon. So, subscribe, chickens! Bye -bye.